Hello everyone, welcome back. This is uh, episode 3 of the Skyblock Challenge. Um, a few things have happened since the last episode. Well, not just, not a, too many things. I, uh, I got two pumpkins, so... I um, actually kind of planned on starting the episode off like this, just to make you guys go, ooh, but no. Um, I got, pretty much what happened is, <clears throat> I shut it off, shut off the recording, I uh, walked over here, oh look, there's a pumpkin, and that's it. <laughs> um, then I uh, made this little addition, moved the cactus over, um, I don't know about this addition in the wall or whatever, I don't remember if that was in the last episode, but um, yeah, so I did that, and that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, I made this safe, mined a tree, that was it, got a melon. I mean, it was just pretty much housekeeping things. Okay, let's continue on our um, on the challenge here. So um, I'm almost dying from starvation, so I'm gonna have to eat some of my uh, melons. So I'm gonna eat up until halfway. Actually, you know what? That'll work. Okay, just in case, we're gonna keep two. And. My new goal is going to be to add to this here, wait for the grass to expand out, and then use bone meal and see if I can get a seed. Because then I can make um, a wheat farm, which is in the rolls, and I have to do that. So I'm going to do that. Wait for the grass to move out. Let's see what else is there to do. I don't have any blocks. Hmm, it's kind of dumb to jump down, jump down here then. Um... Let's see, I have to, what I'm going to do also is move this, <clears throat> uh, mine out this bottom here so I can use the dirt, um, and I think that's it for now. So, let's go ahead and do that. I'm doing this being sure that I don't destroy the, all the grass, but I'm going to have to destroy some of it. Because I want to use this dirt, so. Okay, is there a way to get it from over there? Yeah, there is. Hmm. I don't want to destroy all of it. <laughs> I kind of want to <clears throat> fill it in. You know what? Got one. Let's see if I can get that one now. Hmm. Stay. Good boy. Sweet. Awesome. Got what I wanted. That'll fill in. Put the reed back. Awesome. Now I have enough. Not enough, but I have some um, dirt. Some extra dirt to add to this to wait for it to turn into grass. Gives me better surface area for my for my bone meal so I can just hit it right here hopefully get a lot of um, things around me just so I can get at least one seed because I want to use the the bone meal on the giant mushroom <clears throat> also I'm gonna have, I'm gonna make a better house than this I think I might incorporate this room into it and make it like a big old complex. Also, I plan on um, uh, at the end making sure that I have everything at the same time. So uh, everything that I need to accomplish, I have currently, not just one and then destroy it, you know, like, and then one and then destroy it, you know. I think it would be fun to have them all active at one time. So, yeah. What I'm going to do is get some more blocks from my cobblestone generator, and I'll be back. Hopefully it'll be day. <laughs> okay, cool. That's all done. I powered through the night and pretty much got all this cobblestone you see here. So we got a lot. So let's see. I have a couple new plans. Um, I am going to um, remake... I mean, I'm going to do one of the the challenges. And that is the 
make a platform 24 blocks away from the island challenge thing and it's going to go right here actually so <clears throat> what I'm going to do is make it attach I'm going to go in that direction um, don't know why just chose it because it's north and I thought it would look good <laughs> and what I'm going to do is just go ahead and go on out here cool and make a little platform for mobs to spawn on and I'm hoping that they don't feel like spawning during the day which I know they won't because it's too light I don't remember how many blocks that was anyways but <clears throat> also is it's going to be three wide this walkway so that they have a chance to you know walk over to me um, and I also have a better chance of getting over to them um, if they want to spawn also it's probably be better if I did it the exact same way I was doing before also what I want to do is make them reach the gauntlet which I'm calling the new cactus farm um, so if they do feel like getting over to me I can just go ahead and um, hurry up and sneak behind here and watch them die from the cactus. So that's my plan. If I ever wanted to, you know, if I was ever running away from them, I'd do that. I think what I'm going to do is um, maybe even make a wall up to it. I mean, not really a wall, but I mean, maybe just a one high, like a path breaker you know, on the side over here. Oh no! My trees are burning. No, that's not fair. Yes. Okay, yeah, they're too close. Yeah, I need to move these. I'm just going to get rid of these and then go back to go doing that path. Okay. Yeah, I think that's way too close to that lava. So the next... <gasps> yes. Cool. It feels like I have ADD today. I'm not making fun of anybody with ADD, by the way. I'm just stating the obvious. Okay. Cool. Also, another thing I want to check on this episode um, is those mushrooms, because that's going to be a long time um, working on those mushrooms. Because, let's see, I need 10 jack-o'-lanterns. That's going to be just a little bit of waiting. <coughs> I need... Um, 10 cactus dye, which means I just need to throw it in the furnace over here and uh, get the dye, which won't be hard to do. That isn't very long to do, but I need the 10 mushrooms too. So what I'm think, and I also need to make that giant mushroom. I also need to make 10 bread. Um, so that's going to be waiting for wheat and stuff like that on the farm. Um, I also need to make, let's see. 10 bookcases, so the reeds are going to be in high demand soon, whenever I get that done. Um, and I think that should be it, really. I'm going to go down here and see if any of my mushrooms have duplicated yet. And of course not. <clears throat> After I use that first thing of bone meal, and hopefully I'll get a seed from the, the wheat, I mean seed from the tall grass, I'm going to see I'm going to build that um one of those the red mushroom into a tall red mushroom. And I think that's what I have to make is the giant red, yep. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to check it before I do it. I'm pretty sure that <clears throat> the uh you can get mushrooms out of just normal mushrooms out of the blocks that you mine out of the giant mushroom. I'll check it up before I do it. But if I do, you'll see. Okay, let me ch count all these blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Sweet. So if I'm standing here, they'll be able to spawn over Durr. Awesome. So let's go ahead and make the pad itself. I'm going to make it start here. It'll be like. Let's see, three, four, 
let's see, three, we'll make it seven, make it even number, <laughs> joking, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there we go, cool, cool, getting a little bit of lag, don't know why, there's really nothing to render on the screen, my computer usually does so well, just every once in a while it'll do this, oops, cool, now if I can get a, some sort of skeleton to spawn over here, I'll be one very happy camper, because I'll be able to get his bone meal, and then I wouldn't have to worry about conserving that bone meal over there. I got another melon. Yes. And, uh, I need those melon slices. Gosh, I should not have this bucket on me right now. Especially while building something like this. I'm building this up just so they don't <clears throat> feel like pushing each other off the side or something like that. See how many I can get in this little area. I don't know. It was just a thought. <laughs> cool. Yep, still gonna be three wide. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to reach this, this wall. We'll see. safe and grab one of these. <laughs> this is just so I don't accidentally get, you know, whenever I get shot or something, push off the edge. Get shot by a skeleton. This is probably not the safest of things to do. Maybe I should put like a random pillar. Some pillars in the way. We'll see. As soon as mobs start spawning over there. We shall see. Make it so they want to run into these cool cool that's that how do I get two? Oh, there must have been one stacked up on top of it that pumpkin grows really really fast I'm already at like four pumpkins wow and I'm not I think I'm gonna have enough food now so let me grab maybe three seeds and start planting those Cool. <clears throat> That's pretty cool. Okay, good. Hmm. Put one here and here and here. Just for fun. Awesome. Okay. Ooh, looks like the my plot of grass is better. Is good now. So what I think I'm going to do is try one of these bone meal out and see if we can start planting some wheat. Yes! Very first one. We got a seed. Very happy about that. Sweet. Three. Awesome. I got three wheat I can make. And now that's going to mean that I'm going to get at least <clears throat> three food every single time. That's That's a big victory for me. <laughs> Very big victory for me. Sun already going down? Yeah, it is. Okay, now we're going to be able to test out our gauntlet. Um, while I wait for that, I'm just going to go ahead and see if I can get a couple extra blocks just in case I need to throw something in the way of some of these things spawning at me. I know if I stay on this island, they shouldn't be able to spawn... Um, anywhere within, you know, the right range. So if I even stand over there, I think I counted and it was like just perfect that they can't spawn anywhere within the range of this island. I haven't counted in a while. I might have expanded further than the last time I remember. <clears throat> but we'll see. No, no, that's a bad idea. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should build a pillar in the center just so spiders can't get at me. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Do it 
just like that. And then every once in a while I'll put another one out so skeletons can't get me. Now, I am really thinking, no, that would be a bad idea, that there's going to be a lot of things spawning there. Yep, and I already got my first zombie. There are going to be a lot of things spawning over there because of, you know, it's the only place for them to spawn. So I might get a lot of things over there. We will see, though. Got a creeper already coming over. Gauntlet works. Ooh, needs to grow. <laughs> Die. Come on, zombie. There we go. Don't really care about the experience right now. Okay. Awesome. And I'm going to eat some of these. Because I can. <clears throat> See if I can get my health back up. And... What I think I'm going to do is I'll be back um, after this short message. No, I'll be back. I'm going to get some more of these um, cobblestone, let my health go back up, um, and then we'll wait for a day because I don't think I'm going to allow these. Oh, man. I don't think I'm going to allow these guys to come get me right now. I'll just put these here like that. Make it impossible for things to come and get me. Cool. Awesome. Cool, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, guys, welcome back. Okay, I know. I'm messing around today. Too much fun. Found another pumpkin. Put it on my head. I uh, got a couple more blocks. I had to add a little bit to the house um, overnight. Um, I kind of got jumped <laughs> by... Uh, Lots of bad guys. Apparently, I forgot that if Skeleton can see you through a crack or something, he will try to shoot at you. And in the process of doing that, they probably hit creepers. And all sor sorts of fun stuff, you know, is associated with that. So, yeah. In that process, I lost a sand block. And, um was not very happy about that. Man. Hmm. Go up there and grab it. It falls. Oh man, it went the other way. But yeah, I did lose a sand block. Um, now I have this new kind of design. So I can come in here. I can close the door behind me. Actually, you know what? I want to put a pressure plate there. For funsies. Um, I'm keeping everything in that in here so far. I got some bones, some strings, some arrows, because like I said, I got jumped. <laughs> it wasn't very fun. Um, so. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Dang. Cramp spaces make you forget things. Come on. What I'm kind of amazed is that they're not dying from the sun, I guess, because it's raining. I forgot about that stuff. I, I was kind of hoping that they would be dead by now. No, don't shoot me. Oh. Whew. I should have brought a sword with me. Oh, gosh. Okay. Whew. Can't put that there. But, whatever. I'll just, you know, I'm going to make it. Anyways, um, so yeah, that's what I've been up to. Nothing really, really exciting. I do know also that um, I'm going to be putting a oh gosh, a cap on this. I mean, some sort of over overhang on their side because um, I've been uh, jumped by spiders too many times. Oh man, I got poisoned the first time. Seriously. Ooh, so look at look at how fast these things grow. I didn't even have time to make the. Oh wait, wow, that was. Uh, didn't even have time to make the uh, the block over here. Um, wet. So that's that's just fast. Don't know how many sugar cane I need for ten bookshelves. I'll just go ahead and 
try some of this out. So I know that all I know is that I need a certain amount of pages. Let's go ahead and do that. I did get some more bone meal, like you guys saw. So um, I don't remember how you make books anymore. Ooh, that was not good. I hear him. God, how did you get in here? This is creepy. How did you get in here, dude? You're not dying either. <laughs> Might help if I didn't hit you with a hoe, so. Oh, door's open. That might help. Okay. God, it just creeped me out, though. Oh, man. I hate it when I eat food poisoning every single time. I think it's one, two, three. Oh, yeah, I need more wood, don't I? Yep. I do. Let's try it that much. See how much... See if this is how you do it. I don't remember. Or is it... I don't know. I'll... Let me... It's been a while since I've actually cared. Oh, no, I think it's... There it is. That's the book. And then the bookshelf is like... Lots of books. Gotcha. Try it. Oops. Sweet. Awesome. Need more wood. So I only have three bookshelves so far, so I do need a lot more um reads. So happy. Look look at that! The pumpkins are just on fire today. Of course, none of my food is, you know, doing that that fast, but... Man, that's amazing. I don't have any food left. But, oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know if anybody's done this yet. I do not know if anybody's done this yet. I'm going to try it out, and I want somebody to tell me if they've seen a video where somebody's done this yet. But, um, what I'm going to do is fish for food. <laughs> I know it's been a while since I've ever used a fishing rod, but that's how it goes. Oops, got stuck. Forget if that'll work. I think I needed to throw it straight up. Yeah, I think I did. It's been a little while. There we go. Yep. Just see if it works. It only takes like 60 seconds or something for it to potentially work. This is any body of water, so. Yes, it works! Sweet. Okay, so now I have another source of food that I don't really have to worry about now. Awesome. Awesome. Cool. As soon as I get another one of these cactus, I can um, start smelting it. I'm actually going to start, maybe I'll do half of this, making some charcoal. Okay. Let's see, what else do I still have to do? To make, um, oh, giant mushrooms, that's right. <clears throat> Let's make them on this um, piece of land over here. Big things that I still have to work on are um, mushroom stuff, the bread, the bookcases, um... I have to make a I have to make a small lake, which it's not hard. It's just kind of weird why that's a requirement. I think because we already have an infinite water source. I don't know. Maybe it's because he wants it to make it look like an island. And you know what? I've seen I've seen some pictures of some uh, other people trying this challenge out, and they're really going like all out to make this place like make this thing look like really nice. And, um, as you can tell, I'm not really into that. <laughs> uh, really, I'm just doing the bare minimums here, because when I see a challenge, I don't think, oh, I'm going to, you know, make a beautiful challenge. I'm just going to do the challenge. You know? I don't know. But, 
just for fun, you know, I mean, I, I do a couple things just for fun, you know, like the gauntlet I did, and sun's finally out. Yes! So, hopefully there'll be reduced mobs. Sweet. Okay. Um, let me think. That's four charcoal. Let me make four torches, because I needed to make 20. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to... Let's see, this is one, two, three, four... Man, I can't even put 20 torches in here, can I? <laughs> 4 times 2, 8, 16, 17, 18, 19. I can put 19 torches on the walls just for, you know, from here up. But So I think that's what I'm going to do. 2, 3, 4. Okay. I'm gonna, this is where all my 20 torches are going to go. At least 20 torches. So I'm going to have, like, a wall of torches. And we'll be victorious. Yes. Okay. So there's 18 in here. No, 16, 17, 18, potentially 19. And then I'll have like you know like a sh like a shrine one or something. I don't know. For fun. Okay. There's those for chart. Okay. I need to make stone bricks. So that's one of the things I'm gonna do. Oh my gosh, the sun's already going down. This isn't fair. Ah oh, yes, one of my mushrooms spread. Sweet. Awesome. Okay. Since I have um, extra bone meal, bones, I'm going to steal this bone meal right here and make myself a giant mushroom. <coughs> Boom. Oh, no. Okay, good. Okay. What color was that mushroom? Is that a red mushroom? Because, uh, oh, 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 cool. On the inside, it's brown. That is cool. I have never made one of these before. That is awesome. Okay. Well, what I'm going to do is actually going to collect this one. And, um, what I'll do is use this stuff for the stew. No, I lost one. Because <laughs> I have, uh, then what I'm going to do is be able to steal that brown one and then make a brown one. Hopefully it drops brown mushrooms. Instead of just red ones. This is cool, actually. I've never made one of these, so... Like I said. <laughs> I haven't been listening. Awesome. Make a brown one. Make enough... Have enough mushrooms to make um, more mushrooms, too. It's, uh, and then... Um, that's one part of the challenge. I'm really surviving on this island. Actually, that's what I like about this, is that it isn't just, oh yeah, you know do well it's survive and i like that you know i'm actually almost thriving here cool